Hi, I'm Troy Reiner with Grace Engineered Products. I'm going to explain to you a couple of our voltage awareness products. We're going to start with Voltage Vision. This is part number R-3W. Basically what we're looking at here is a three-phase electrical monitor. Uh, we're faking it out right now. We do not have three-phase power in this room. Under normal circumstances, you probably would not see anything indicating on ground unless, of course, there is voltage leaking to the ground at the time. So let's pretend that we're not actually seeing anything indicating on ground. Usually what you're going to see is, under normal circumstances, you're going to see line 1, line 2, and line 3 indicating that there's live power there. Uh, any, anything out of the ordinary, like a phase loss or uh, when you throw the disconnect and a phase stays connected, it will indicate that by either lights being there when they shouldn't be or vice versa. Um, this, is, this is the power on option. Uh, this is what it would look like with the power off option. And as you can see, basically when we hit the disconnect, the power went off immediately. Now if you've got a panel, let's say with a drive in it or something like that, we're going to go up here and take a look at this, this unit here. We're, what we're using here is a, is a small display unit that we take around to various shows. And basically what this is going to indicate is, uh, is stored energy, like in a drive, how the capacitors will have that residual energy even after you throw the disconnect. What's going to happen here is you're going to see that even after the disconnect is thrown, the LEDs continue to indicate that there's voltage still there until it drops below either a 30 or a 40 volt threshold, depending on if you're operating in DC or AC mode. The next, unit I want, this next units I want to show you, this is called check volt, and essentially what it is doing, it is doing the same thing that the, that the voltage vision unit does, except for it does require a human interface, in this case a non-contact voltage detector. And essentially what we're going to do here is you, you've, got, you've got that your, uh, your, your disconnect is indicating that the, that the power is live. To verify that, you want to test this to a known source, for, first of all, and then second of all, insert it into the check bolt itself and make sure that it is that they are operating properly and then, then return it to the known source to make sure your non-contact voltage detector was working properly.